Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. In this video, I'll show you how you can easily create a layout grid in Figma. Now let's begin by inserting our frame and you can either do that by hitting A or F on your keyboard or you can just go up here and select your frame. And now you can select one of these presets. I'll just select my desktop and then I'll just do a MacBook Air. Now with our frame selected, you can also select your frame under your layers and then find the hash symbol and then this is your artboard or frame. Now let's we'll select our frame and then here in the design panel you can see where it says layout grid. Let's just add a layout grid with the plus icon and we can adjust that by selecting this icon and then going to this drop down where it says grid and then we can make this either some columns or rows. I'll begin by making my columns and then I'll just add 12 columns for the desktop layout. Now, as you see, our width is auto and it's grayed out, and that is because the type is stretch. So let's change it from stretch to center, and now we can increase the width of our layout grid. And this is especially helpful if you're designing a layout for an ultra wide monitor. But I'll just make this stretch and then just keep it as auto. And uh, the gutter is the space between your columns and the margin is the space around. So let's also just make our margin 20. Uh, or even 40. I usually like to double my margin. And let's go ahead under our layout grid, add a row now. So change it from grid to rows. And then yeah, we can increase or decrease the, the count of our rows. And uh, for both the column and rows, you can change the color or the opacity. Now with our layout grid created, let's create a rectangle shape and then just draw this out. And as you see, it snaps to our layout grid. And that's how you can easily make a layout grid in Figma. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, it would mean a lot if you left a thumbs up and subscribed if you haven't already. It helps a lot to support the channel and to continue making content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.